Oh my goodness, what's happening? Guys? Guys, can you still hear me? Guys? What? Ness? Guys? Where are you going? What's happening? We're breaking up. I can't hear you. Guys? Guys? Hello? Oh, guys! Guys! Love you too, babe. Um... The war against Gygus is over. Man, there's Ness and crew, guys. Damn. What's that? I think they're moving on. I don't know, guys. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, Pooh's the man. You know, he got there first. He was powerful. But Jeff's smart. Paula had that psychic firepower. And then now here's Ness, like, waking up, like, everybody's like, what the fuck? We're back? Oh my god. This is a terrible nightmare. Our travels together end here. Our travels together end here. I must return to Delam and use this experience for the good of my country. Ness, Paula, Jeff, let me demonstrate a strange power before I go. I realized this power as a child. PSI, farewell. Now. I'll see you again someday. Now that's cool. Paula? Ness? It was great to hang out with you guys. It really was. I'm glad that I had the chance to use some of the theories that I have been studying so hard. It's remarkable. If, just maybe, well, if you two get hitched someday, maybe I'll be the one that fixes your broken electronic appliances. I'm going to stay here for a while and see if I can learn more from Dr. and Donuts. I mean, from my dad. So it looks like this is goodbye for now, my friends. Yes, will you escort me home? I'll be glad to. I'll miss you all. I'll miss all of you, but I have to go back to being just a regular kid. Well, I gotta get going. It's a miracle! A miracle that has only happened because of your great courage. Believe me, I went through a lifetime's worth of stress while you were gone. I just wish I could have come with you as a robot. I should have used the phase disorder. What a story that would have been! Scientists and four kids saved the world! <laughs> it was fun hanging out together. Ness opened the present. There's a letter from Tony inside. Ness takes it. 
You know, I've never read the letters, guys. There's a letter from Mom inside. And there's a letter from Kids inside. Dear Paula, how are you doing? I'm fine. I fine too. So are me. Me also. Me okay. Please come and play with us. Please come and play with us again at the Pole Star Preschool. Oh yeah, one more thing. Bring us some presents if you have any. Sincerely, your friends at the Pole Star Preschool. Dear Jeff. Everything's really going great here. I wish I could have gone with you on your adventure even just part of the way. But instead I'm sitting here waiting for you in winters. I want to see you again as soon as possible. I can't wait to see your cheerful face. I bet your glasses are dirty. If you come back, I'll clean them for you. Like I said, I'm waiting for you. Yours truly, Tony. P.S. Don't show this letter to anyone. Aw, oh, his friend. His roommate got sappy. Dear Ness, how are you? Sincerely, you left home on your journey. Things have changed around here. For example, I don't have as much laundry. Also, we don't seem to eat pizza as much as we used to. I heard that you defeated some universal evil character. What was it? Googie or something like that? Well, that sounds really great. I want to hear all the details, so hurry home, okay? Tracy, Zeno, and I are waiting for you. Love, Mama. That's pretty freaking cool, man. Incredible! Excellent! I'm not quite sure what for... What for? But congratulations on a job well done. If we ever have the chance to get together again, let's go on a picnic or something. Maybe we could play horseshoes, too. It was in winters that we last met. I just got here, <laughs> Yeah? Was scared. Now KO. I strong. Boing! Yeah? Well, in front of everyone, I'm going to just disappear. Alright, let's take Paula home. We're just going to walk through her hometown. Hey look, it's the Chaos Theater where we went on our first date together. Those were fun times, and the Runaway Five were parked here. Those guys were awesome. Didn't I see you at the top of the theater in Forside? So you're a Runaway Five groupie too? No, we are a part of the Runaway Five. That's the difference between you and me. All right, Paula, here's your home. Ness, thank you for escorting me home. There was something I wanted to tell you, but I've forgotten it. I'm sure I'll remember by the time I see you again. Well, I guess this is it. You just tell him you love him, girl. McFussy Bear, thank you for the host, my friend. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Uh, so long. See ya. Bye. Really? That's it? After that whole trip? Girl, I'm following you in your home. I don't get a hug or nothing. Really? After saving the world? Meow! Where the hell did y'all get a cat? Oh, yeah. Ness, I guess it's time for you to go home. Everyone is probably worried about you. Man, so like, our ridiculous journey that brought us this far in the game. Wow, 
It's over. You're a very strong young man. My opinion of you has changed. Perhaps you should continue dating Paula. Just treat her right. Come by and visit any time. You can even sleep on the living room couch instead of the one in the den. Nice! You've lost some weight since I saw you last, Ness. Paula must have had quite an adventure. I'm glad you live so close to us. Why don't you drop by more often? I'm working and making better pizza. Or, I'm working at making better pizza. Nah, that's alright. Store-bought is fine. I'll call Domino's. We'll make a, we'll make a fun time of it. <laughs> the boy's smiling. Hey, let's take, let's actually walk home. I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk the route that I know. Alright. Let me get on the corner. I'm gonna look both ways. Alright, I'm crossing. See that? That van just would have came out of nowhere. Alright, crossing. Here we go, guys. I'm not even going to teleport home. I'm actually going to walk. This is the way I came to get to Paula's house. The world's a better place, my friends. I had an amazing adventure. I, I couldn't have had the best of friends ever. I couldn't have better. Wonder if the police chief's still mad at me. I mean, we did. I did beat him in a fight. Let's let's go see. He's he's right here. Wonder if they'll give me a police escort home. Oh, I can't talk to him. Nuts. Crossing. I'm in my hometown. Everybody loves me. Okay, here we go. You used to look much more helpless. Yeah, that's right. I know I used to. If she's in a good mood, a lady in the library will kiss you. Nah, better not. The last time I fought anything that was trying to kiss me, it was the kit death kit, uh, kiss of death, and it was trying to actually kill me. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay away from kisses for a little while. Unless they're from Paul. Mom, I'm home. Wow, you've become such a strong young man. I'd like to hear all of your stories, but I don't want to annoy you as soon as you walk through the door. After all your chats with people you met on your adventure are finally over, please come back here. The photo man brought an album by. I'd like to look at it with you. Okay, that's fine. That's uh PSI teleport to uh Delam. Oh, that's right. You actually do get to talk to everyone. Wow, that's crazy. I didn't realize that. No credits. Uh, Master Toby, I, you actually got to talk to all your friends. So I got to come here and talk to Pooh. I already I took Paula home already. I got to go to Winners and talk to them. I got to go to the Tenda Village. I got to go to my local burger joint in my hometown. The library lady and my friends back in one end as well. So I'll do all the traveling first, and then I'll go back home and talk to the library lady and my friends in one end. You're here. We have little, but stay and rest for a long for a while. But I'm impressed. You did so well for one who hasn't had much training. Well, thank you, my friend. Thank you, Pooh. <laughs> 